Hey guys, this week in the rundown, we have the latest on the updates to MAP and new apps focused on life skills and GMTs. Quotas for the Fiscal Year 16 Meritorious Advancement Program, or MAP, have been released in NAVADMIN 089-16. This year, there will be 799 more quotas than last year, the first for MAP. In total, over 3,000 quotas will be available for sailors to advance to pay grades E4 through E6. Some of the big policy changes this year include expanding MAP to short commands and pack sailors. The changes were made to allow more COs to recognize and advance their top sailors. Check out our story on Navy.mil for more details, along with our interview with CMP and Fleet Beldo on Navy Live, where they talk about the recent changes. Naval Education and Training Command has released three new apps this week. First, a new course and mobile app that focuses on improving life skills. The four-day course is taught to sailors after completion of recruit training, and the mobile app helps to reinforce the skills they learn. Some topics covered in both the class and mobile app include paying entitlements, nutrition, physical readiness, responsible alcohol use, and avoiding misuse of prescription drugs, to name a few. Also released, Two apps to complete GMTs for Record Management and Privacy and Personnel Identifiable Information, or PII. To find the free Navy apps, use search terms Life Skills Reach Back, PII, or Record Management in the app stores. Finally, we talk with Mick Pond Stevens next week on Sapper as we wrap up Sexual Assault Awareness and Prevention Month. Be sure to check out the rundown next week for that interview. Well, that's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople at gmail.com. For the Chief of Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching.